My Breakup Story, Shauna Mokler and Oscar de la Hoya Shauna Mokler is reflecting on her breakup from Oscar de la Hoya, and how they split custody of daughter Adriana. He said, I won't see you or the baby until she's 16, if I sued him for palimony, Mokler, 48, claimed during the Wednesday, January 10th episode of the Dumb Blonde podcast. He got out of the car, I'll never forget this, and he goes, I have more money than God. Don't be too hard on me. And he left. I cried. I sued him for palimony, and I won. I really didn't have a choice. Mokler started dating De La Hoya, now 50, in 1997, and the duo got engaged one year later. They welcomed Adiana, now 24, in 1999 less than one year before they split. He didn't see the baby and I until she was about 16. She didn't know her father growing up, Mokler added. They've made amends. He's made amends with me. He's apologized. Shauna Mokler's dating history, from Dennis Quaid to Travis Barker. Adiana, for her part, previously detailed her father's estrangement in his The Golden Boy documentary, which dropped in July 2023. I would only see him every so often, maybe, like, once a year, Adiana recalled. And I remember, I think it might have been fourth grade or something, and we were supposed to get dinner and then go to Color Me Mine because I loved art. And I remember trying to think of, like, what I would say. Like, am I going to call him dad? And I remember going to Color Me Mine and he painted, like, a cheeseburger, and I had the cheeseburger in my room for, it's probably still somewhere, to be honest. She added, I think a lot of people knew him better than I did because they watched his career. So my idea of him wasn't necessarily from our relationship, but it was more from who I was told he was. Mokler also claimed on Wednesday that she split from De La Hoya over infidelity on the boxer's part when Adiana was a toddler. Everything to know about Shauna Mokler's drama with her and Travis Barker's son Landon, daughter Alabama over the years. There were all these third parties, Mokler alleged. He just lost his first fight. I met him at Universal, and said, do you want this anymore? Mokler said that De La Hoya assured her of his love months before she saw footage of him escorting his ex-wife Millie Caretcher to the Latin Grammy Awards. There he is holding hands with his now ex-wife. I just remember I lost my breath, Mokler said. There was no backla sh, publicly. I didn't stand a chance. The next day they had a lawyer come to the house and say, you and the baby need to move out. It just became just A.S., though whirlwind. He never called me again. He had his assistant, tell me we were done. I really thought in that moment that my life was over. Mokler eventually moved on with Blink-182 drummer Travis Barker, whom she said on Wednesday was, more the love of my life, than the La Jolla. Mokler and Barker, 48, wed in October 2004 before welcoming son Landon, now 20, and daughter Alabama, now 18. Mokler and Barker eventually split in 2008, nearly 14 years before he married Kourtney Kardashian. Kardashian, 44, and Barker welcomed son Rocky in November 2023. Oscar de la Hoya's family guide, meet his six kids and their moms. Following Mokler and Barker's divorce, they prioritized co-parenting Landon and Alabama. Barker also remained close with former stepdaughter Adiana. I'm grateful that Barker was there, you know, as a father figure for my daughter. I have to be grateful that Shauna was a mother to Adiana, and just know my place, basically, you know. De La Hoya told Entertainment Tonight in July 2023. My place, I'm obviously a father and I'm proud of it. But, again, I'm grateful for what they've done. Especially with Barker. He's obviously stepped up to the plate. De La Hoya also shares son Jacob, 25, with Tony Alvarado, son Devin, 24, with Angelique McQueen and kids Oscar, 17, Nina, 14, and Victoria, 9, with Correcture. He admitted in The Golden Boy that he left it up to the mothers to take care. Please share and subscribe my channel.